Hi, this is Bob from Bob Johnson's Computer Stuff. And if you're looking for an online tough book community that gives tips, tricks, and support, hit the subscribe and bell button for notifications of all our newest upcoming videos. Today, I'll be answering a common question from our customers. What does a Wi-Fi switch do and where do I find it? So stay tuned. Hi guys, thanks for hanging out and watching this video. What I wanted to go over today was, we get a lot of uh, tech support questions either via chat or over the phone saying, hey, my Wi-Fi worked yesterday on my tough book, but today it's not working. It tells me I'm in airplane mode or it says need to turn the switch on in order to make it work, but they have no idea what it's talking about. So they call us and we just say, oh, you just need to turn the switch on. So what I'm gonna go over right now is where's the switch on some of the more popular Panasonic Tough Books. And I'll start with the CF-19. This is an MK8. It has um, uh, all the standard features you come expect on a 19. By the way, if you wanna learn more about the CF-19, check out my video. We do a nice top 10 uh, features of the CF-19 and we also walk through some of the specs with it. So check out that video. I'll put the link right here for you. Uh, on this unit, there's actually a Wi-Fi switch, but it's in the uh, right behind the PCMCI door where the PCMCI slot is. You'll note right here is the wireless on-off switch. So if you lose your Wi-Fi on the CF-19 and it was working an hour ago, you might have inadvertently hit the switch right here. It's right next to the SD card slot right there. So that's on the CF-19. Pretty easy to get to. Uh, if you have any problems with your Wi-Fi, check out that switch first. This is the CF-31, and this is a MK4 CF-31. And by the way, I've got some nice video on all the specs on this unit. So if you're interested in this unit, check out my top 10 video as well as my walkthrough. I do a nice walkthrough on the CF-31. So check that out if you're interested. Well, the, the, the Wi-Fi switch on the CF-31 happens to be right about where the multi-bay port is and you'd have your CD-ROM or whatever in there or extra battery, but you'll see the switch is right here. And again, that's right next to the SD card slot on the CF-31. So that's where the wireless switch is on the, on the 31. Now these are, our, that, those were our fully rugged units. Now I'm gonna talk a little bit about the popular uh, semi-rugged units like the CF-53. Now the CF-53, you would think, there's a, a switch on this unit? Absolutely. This one happens to be an MK4 um, standard unit. Nice. Again, I do a nice CF-53 walkthrough, giving you all the specs on these things as well as some uh, common issues that you run into on them. So check out those videos. I'm gonna include the links here so that you guys can watch those videos as well if you're interested in the CF-53. So the Wi-Fi switch on the CF-53 is right behind the door, the PCM-CIA door, where you have the SD card reader, and there you go, there's your switch on off. This one is kind of smaller than the rest of them, but definitely on off switch if you need to um, check that out. So that's on the CF-53. Uh, the newer CF-54 also has a switch. And again, check out my videos on the walkthrough and common issues on the CF-54. I'm leaving the links here for you. Uh, we, we did some nice videos on what this unit's all about, if you're interested. But that switch, we'll get to the switch. On the CF-54, your switch is right behind the SD card slot cover. So you'll see the audio jack. Here's the on off switch. There's the SD card reader. So if you're having Wi-Fi problems on your CF-54, that's where that switch is. So I hope this helped you guys out a little bit. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions or comments, hey, tell me about your CF-54 or 53. Leave those below. Also tell me about your 31 or CF-19. Mm -hmm.